All right. This is just the fastest way to do it, right? <laughs> Welcome back, everybody, to Ravenhurst. I am an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to head north. We're going to talk to Trader Hugh for opening trade routes, and we are going to uh, do some more quests, hopefully from Hugh. So let's kill this wolf and get the meat and all the good giblets off of him. Is that a zombie bear or a bear bear? If it's a bear bear, we could get some meat off of him, too. I think it's a bear bear. Yeah, it's just a bear bear. With 1,800 hit points. Trying to get headshots off on him. Alright, here. Let's do this. Well, that's one way to do it. That is one way to do it. All right, let's deal with these Zikaruskis. We get some um, some steroids or, or the testosterone or whatever the hell that stuff's called uh, that we can use to make steroids. I don't know. Do we know how to make steroids though? We have a uh, Kim bench. Let's look at that really quick. Recipe steroids. No, it's locked. Okay. It is locked. All right. Let's put uh, those in there. We'll turn the bones into, into bones. Uh, looks like I'm making more ammo too. Animal fat can go in here along with the red meat. And we'll turn this into leather. Excellent. All right. Let's put uh, the extra shotgun shells away. I'm going to take the two stacks of 7.62 because, you know, we're going to start using this more um, so we can, you know, level it up. Um, so we might as well wait until we get nine more rounds and then we'll have two full stacks. Okay, we are here at uh, Trader Hughes. We will turn in the opening trade routes quest. Where did you come from? Stupid dog. And then uh, see if he's got a tier 3 retrieve only for us. Let's get the giblets off this guy. You too? All right. Got to kill him or they'll bang bang on the traitor and cause all kinds of problems. Looks like he has an aggro on us. Okay. Of course, yeah, Trader Hughes already been thumped on. Yeah, whatever. He's got 100,000 hit points, so I'm not too worried about him. Incredible. Okay. Now, uh, do you have any jobs? We, he's got, uh, he doesn't have any fetch onlys. Damn it. All right, well, um, let's look at his inventory. SMG turret, a blue pistol. Nothing really all that great in the super, uh, or secret stash, rather. That's kind of nice. I'll, I'll bet you, though, pretty soon we're going to probably come across to start seeing steel sledges, is my guess. Got a 44 Magnum. We can make 44s, but really, really terrible ones, level-wise. Tactical. It's got two tacticals. Yeah, nothing actually too terribly impressive. I suppose, I mean, this would be a 
pretty decent upgrade from what we have now. 6,000 coin, though. Kind of expensive. Kind of expensive. Um, it does 4483. See, it doesn't do that much more than what our current one does. And it's, it's Quit just wasting my time. <laughs> it's just a bit on the expensive side. Let's look in here really quick. Um, can of stock. We need, we could use this for, uh, making Kuzuma, was it? A gumbo. Oh, I didn't bring my money with me. Okay, well, whatever. Food is no longer a problem for us, thank God. Okay, I think there's... We could either go to the desert, to the east. But I think there's a trader... Another trader Joel in this town to the west. Plus, we haven't really spent much time, if any, in the town to the west. So we might be able to find some more gas there. So let's let's head over there. Zombo spawning inside the trader. What's the world coming to? Okay, that takes care of them yahoos. Um, jailbreakers? Nah, we don't need jailbreakers. More? Oh, for goodness sakes. Come on, game. Edgar, hold still. There you go. Okay, let's go talk to Trader Joel. Actually, let's rip him off first. Come on, give us something good. Um, all right, we'll sell his own book to him. Hey, buddy. Okay, he's got a fetch only a quest. It's uh to the west, so that's going to be back near Trader Hugh. I like you, friend. I've got work for you. It's a mine. Okay, it's interesting. In um, and let's take a look at his inventory. Secret stash first. That's an SMG5 schematic. That would be kind of cool. Player vending machine, scrap chest, armor, spotlight, grave digger. All right, let's get his normal. Shepherd's pie recipe. That would be... You know what? We probably need a stove for that. And by the way, I still haven't seen you guys' comments yet. I'm... I'm getting ahead of you again a little bit. Sorry about that, but... You know, on the plus side, it means you get ep you get episodes every single day. Okay, <laughs> uh, on the on the bad side or the downside, our comments aren't in sync. But I'm just having too much fun playing. So there you go. Uh, all right. Well, um, this would be kind of nice to have. The problem though is that if we made one now, it would be a terrible, terrible quality, and um, we'll probably find a better one before we level up enough to make a decent quality one. So I don't think that's really worth it. If, you know, when you stop and kind of think about it that way, you know. Um, so, Thanks okay. You be careful out there. You be careful out there. All right. Well, let's go do his fetch quest. Uh, we might as well nab his coffee since we can uh, harvest it here in Ravenhurst. We wouldn't be able to do this in vanilla. And uh, we didn't look at his his uh, workbenches. Not that that matters a whole bunch anyways. What we could do is loot them though 
we'll just see what's in the bag after it breaks. All right, well, let's uh, head on over to the quest location then. I forgot to sell him his uh, book back. Safe travels. All right, guys, I'm back. Um, I actually forgot to start the recording again. Typical, typical old guy maneuver. Um, but I actually canceled that quest we took from Trader Hugh because it was actually to the west, and I don't want to go that. Oh, nice. Uh, I want to go that far to the west. Uh, so I'm still in the same town, and I just did the this junkyard because it has a couple of um, of gas tanks here. Uh, so we did that. We're just kind of just doing a quick loot of the place. I killed the usual requisite 178,000 zombies to get in here, but nothing super amazing. Down with you. Actually, that didn't kill you, did it? This will. Eventually. Okay, so yeah, and then, you know, as you guys probably know, in the junkyard there are a couple of a transformers line on the ground. I've already looted those to get some steel. So we got three pieces of steel. Plus we're going to do this traffic light too. So let's jump up and do that really quick. Okay. There's more stuff in here. We could loot, but we hit the safe, got the steel, got the gas. Those were the main reasons why we came in here. So let's get back to the bike. And what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to keep driving around and see if we can find any more gas pumps uh, in this town while we're here. There we go. And then after that, we might as well check this box too, since it's right here. After that, we will probably go back. Maybe we'll head south to Trader Jen's town and see what kind of quest she has for us. Or we could go, uh, we could go into the desert too, uh, to the other Trader Joel. That's another possibility. Um, but anyways, I'll figure it out and I'll bring you guys back when uh, when I figure it out. All right, guys, change of plans. Uh, I found a pass and gas here uh, just a little ways down the road from the junkyard. Um, and I think we're going to go ahead and just loot this place, even though we're not doing a quest for it. Because um, I don't... I'm going to kind of run out of time if I go to a, all the way to another trader and then still try and get a question in this episode. So, oh, nice. So, yeah, let's just do the passing gas here. Um, let's put these back on and see if we can find some, you know, some nice fat loots in here. Might as well just wake you all up because you're all going to wake up and bother me anyways. Let's go ahead and we got a mummy. Okay, anybody running? No, it doesn't look like we have any runners. Okay, what we're going to do is get this on our toolbar. All right, we got to kill this uh this dude that throws the molotovs. How many of them are there? Goodness. Okay, he's dead. I thought I heard some zombies coming from over here. Guys, I'm trying to loot this place. So, can you guys just stay in your own Yard here. All right. This is just the fastest way to do it, right? <laughs> Only problem is we're attracted. <laughs> we're attracted a million other ones now. Maybe I should be putting my XP glasses back on with this many kills. Holy crap. Okay, 
Let's get him bunched up again here. Oh, that one hurt us a little bit. But hey, look at how many we took out. Okay. Get you bleeding. Yeah, we weren't quite far enough away from that one, were we? I think I found a new way, guys, to mass kill all of the zombies that Ravenhurst spawns in on you. Moving forward. This is what we're going to do. We're just going to have a hundred pipe bombs in our inventory all the time. No exception. No, not a hundred, but... Ooh, nice. Our, uh, let's see. Craft military stealth boots. Nice. Okay, cool. And 4, 000, or 400 coin. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. Okay. Are we done? Are we good? Can we proceed? Let's check this. Well, we should probably take a bandage, too. Like I said in the earlier episode, we're our own worst enemy. Okay, you guys didn't all, like, just respawn again, did you? Nope, there's the fire guy. Kill them all? It would appear so. Okay, are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. I hear footsteps back there. He looks like he's made out of coal. Okay. All right, let's loot. so lucky that didn't kill us. Oh, we're so lucky. Holy crap. Hola. Okay, let's go. Was not expecting to find a glower in there. Uh, we are like severely encumbered right now. Um, so yeah, that was, <clears throat> that was a very calculated risk. You know, throwing that bomb and not being able to move away from it fast, but it actually worked in our favor this time. <laughs> I thought for sure I was going to die. Okay. Um, there's still some really good stuff in that back room, and I really don't want to leave. Um, so maybe we're going to have to have a come to Jesus meeting with our inventory. These are easy to get. I don't need that. I don't need that. Uh, easy to get. Uh, easy to make. I hate to throw away animal hide, but again, relatively easy to get. Let's drink this. Um, these are worth 62 to sell. I just don't want to throw ammo away. Okay, so let's put that ammo in there. Uh, we don't need the that. We don't need the wires. Oh, man, I hate to throw brass away, too, guys, but we have plenty of brass. So I'm going to do it. I wouldn't normally do that, but I'm going to do it. We can throw the bones away. We can throw the bulls away. Uh, I got lots of ink back at the base. And uh, we can throw the dye away. This would probably be worth fixing up and selling. We can make a pretty decent amount of money on that. Okay, so that got us back into a, a little bit better situation here. 
Um, now we can put uh, some stuff in here now. So let's just put stuff in here. We're not likely to re-loot. Um, we can put this on here. Wait. Uh, well, I actually want to put that on there, but can we put the... We already got that on there. What about here? There we go. Yeah, we'll put this on here. Right now it does 64 block damage. That bumped it up to 69, so that was worth doing. Okay, so that gives, gets us some spots back. Let's look in here again for a second. Anything else stack? Oh, yeah, we got some more gas in there too. Good. Good, 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 good. Okay, so uh, let's head back over there, uh, but we have to really be careful of if there's more glowers. Yeah, we were, like, super lucky <laughs> that pipe bomb didn't kill us. Um, and I don't know if you guys know this or not, but I've got a rad remover on here. So, um, you know, that helps quite a bit. All right, let's go back in here. All right, we've got a blower in that room. So what we're going to do is give them a couple... I'm not worried about the soldiers. It's just the glower I want to kill. Okay, did we get them? Oh, did we get all of them? I think we did. Nice. Okay. Let's loot. Where did you come from? I'm glad this block block didn't get destroyed. Oh, look at that. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. We got a couple more Zeeks out here. Let's just block. How many do we have? At least two. Okay, that takes care of them. These pipe bombs, man, I'll tell you what, they are really working out good for us. They're giving us, you know, the edge that we need to survive in this freaking mod. <laughs> That's what they're doing, quite literally. Um, oh, nice. As long as we don't kill ourselves, right? Okay. The loot's getting really good. Well, I mean, it's getting good based upon where we're currently at. We're starting to see some pretty good stuff. Okay, um, yeah, we will take that. That's governed by construction tools in Ravenhurst, though, not mining like it is in vanilla. Let's see if we can get in here with one lock bit. Come on, baby. Ah, you son of a... Nice. Look at that hunting knife, too, man. Wow. Yeah, good loot. Good loot. That does 43 range to damage. This is one of those things that we needed to make the... Uzuma, was it? Motorcycle, but we also need the actual bench for it, too. I wonder if you could find the schematic for that in here in the car place. That would be useful. All right. We're already 19 things over encumbered again. You know, we're leaving the brass this time. It's not something I normally would do, but we have to, we have to be judicious with our inventory. Three steel, you betcha. Okay, let's see if we can offload some of this stuff back in the bike again. Okay, that gained us a couple of spots. Um, that's worth selling. We don't need the nails. We could take a chance and drink this. We have a 10% chance of dysentery, though. Um, I'm going to chuck one glue. I don't have any cloth to turn it into duct tape anyways, and I, I can make glue. We have a chem bench at the base now, so... This we're probably just going to sell because our, our blue steel axe is quite a bit better. And we don't need these arrows. 
so we can get rid of that. Don't think there's anything else. Well, hey, let's get rid of the hinge. Those are easy to get. I don't think there's anything else I want to get. Uh, we can make the large medipack, so we want to keep all blood bags. Those are fairly um, hard to come by. Okay. Uh, let's also do this. Let's take the bike around back. We'll just park it right here. So we got this other room here to do. Because we're still on the lookout for jars as usual. Going to leave all of that. Let's go up on the roof, and we still have the garage to do, too. It's amazing how much loot is in, you know, such a relatively small POI. I see a bunch of Zeeks up here, but is it worth the fight? Is there any significant loot up here? Oh, shit, they're running, too. All right. Where's my bike? Yeah, I don't... I want to say there probably isn't anything really good up there. Maybe I'm wrong. But that's a lot of ferals. I just want to kind of pull them away. Okay, let's park here. You're so freaking encumbered, man. But I want to... I want to finish loot in this place as best as we can. Uh, that is worth taking to sell. Why do you have to be feral, Nurse Nancy? Okay, so we have at least two Zeeks right by the door here. Maybe three. Okay, let's reload this. Pop our last bandage. I've got several more at the base, but it's the last one we have with us here. And let's just bring something down to free up a slot. How many nine mils? Actually, I do have nine mils in the bike, but that's all right. We don't want to use this right now, anyways. We have no skill in it. Okay, I guess those guys are beating on the other side of the wall, maybe. No, nope, we're going to leave the brass. Man, that pains me to do that, you guys, but. Oh, they're trying to come down from up there. Are you feral? Even if you were, you're dead now. Somebody just fell down. Hold still. Well, if everybody on the roof's going to just jump down, we might as well go up there, right? Uh, we're out of bandages, so we're going to have to take this for healing now. Uh, where are you? I don't feel safe right now. Oh, there you are. Are you feral? You are feral. Can we maybe do this? We certainly can. You know what we're going to call this episode, you guys? We're going to call this episode Fun with Explosives. 
That's exactly what we're going to call it. Here, let's see if we can oh <laughs> I think I threw that one a little too far here let's try and get it up in that hole again oh shit where are you where are you oh, I did I couldn't see him <laughs> okay oh shit we're so far away to it I didn't put my bedroll down again that's okay. And no, it's not okay. It's absolutely not okay. And now I'm going to have to pay the price for it. All right. <laughs> Guys, I'm going to wrap up this episode here um, because it's time to do so. I'm going to run back to the bike. I'll keep my finger ready on the record button in case something crazy happens. Um, but I'm going to go back, get all that stuff. And probably just, well, I mean, there's a couple more things in the, in the garage we really should check. So I'll check that. Uh, anything significant, I will get on camera. Otherwise, I will just uh, see you guys in the next episode. And we will do whatever we're going to do. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.